Thank you for connecting to Redeemer Lent Online. This week, we are going to enter into reading of scripture that draws us into the story of Easter. Day two is where we will take a look at John 18. Simon Peter followed Jesus, as did another of the disciples. That one disciple was acquainted with the high priest, so he allowed he was allowed to enter the high priest's courtyard with Jesus. Peter had to stay outside the gate. Then the disciple who knew the high priest spoke to the woman watching at the gate, and she let Peter in. The woman asked Peter, You're not one of the man's disciples, are you? No, he said, I am not. Because it was cold, the household servants and the guards had made a charcoal fire. They stood around it, warming themselves, and Peter stood with them, warming himself. Meanwhile, as Simon Peter was standing by the fire, warming himself, they asked him again, You're not one of his disciples, are you? He denied it, saying, No, I am not. But one of the household slaves of the high priest, a relative of the man whose ear Peter had cut off, asked, Didn't I see you out there in the olive grove with Jesus? Again, Peter denied it, and and immediately the rooster crowed. Jesus' trial before Caiaphas ended in the early hours of the morning. Then he was taken to the headquarters of the Roman governor. His accusers didn't go inside because it would defile them, and they wouldn't be allowed to celebrate the Passover. So Pilate, the governor, went out to them and asked, What is your charge against this man? We wouldn't have handed him over to you if he weren't a criminal, they retorted. Then take him away and judge him by your own law, Pilate told them. Only the Romans are permitted to execute somebody, the Jewish leaders replied. This fulfilled Jesus' prediction about the way he would die. Then Pilate went back into his headquarters and called for Jesus to be brought to him. Are you, are you the king of the Jews, he asked him. Jesus replied, Is this your own question, or did others tell you about me? Am I a Jew, Pilate reported? Your own people and their leading priests brought you to me for trial. Why? Why have you done? Jesus answered, My kingdom is not an earthly kingdom. If it were, my followers would fight to keep me from being handed over to the Jewish leaders. But my kingdom is not of this world. Pilate said, So you are a king? Jesus responded, You say I am a king. Actually, I was born and came into the world to testify to the truth. All who, all who love the truth recognize what I say is true. What is truth? Pilate asked. Then he went out again to the people and told them, He is not guilty of any crime, but you have a custom of asking me to release one prisoner each year at Passover. Would you like me to release the king of the Jews? But they shouted back, No, not this man. We want Barabbas. Barabbas was a revolutionary. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you. As we look forward toward Easter. Lord, draw us into a deeper relationship with who you are. Lord, as we are questioned about our faith, make us strong, make us bold. Lord, allow us to to be confident in the faith that we have of you. And Lord, as we enter into this season of waiting, waiting for Easter and waiting for what you are bringing to us. Lord, may we wait with patience, but also hopeful expectation that as we understand, as we listen to, as we hear this story that draws you to the cross, may we be encouraged and may you, Lord, be king of our lives. And we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen.